It was a warm day in West Michigan. Today's high temperature was 57 degrees, 58 in Kalamazoo, well above average for this time of year. And now the temperatures are tumbling. We're at 37 in Fremont at the moment, 40 in Grand Rapids and 42 in Kalamazoo with mostly clear to partly cloudy skies. A cold front will be passing over West Michigan into tonight and tomorrow, reinforcing that cooler air and allowing for high temperatures to largely remain in the 30s throughout the day on Friday and again into Saturday. There's even a chance of a few passing flurries. You can see the colder air towards our north and our west, and it will be sweeping over our area over the next few days. Breaking down what we need to know, Friday and Saturday, we will have that winter air returning. Rebounding temperatures on Sunday and Monday back to the 40s and 50s, but by Tuesday, the warmest day, a high temperature of 63, and there will be a chance of scattered showers and a few thunderstorms. Tonight's overnight low will be 32 in Grand Rapids and in Battle Creek, 33 in Kalamazoo and Muskegon, and 30 degrees in Big Rapids. So a cold night, a chilly start for tomorrow with a few flurries possible late in the afternoon and evening. Winds will be strong from the north, ranging between 10 to about 20 miles an hour. What that's going to do is knock down our feels like temperatures. So our daytime highs will be in the lower 40s to the upper 30s. We factor in the wind, it will feel even colder. The best chance for some sunshine will be in the morning and then eventually by the afternoon and evening. Once that cold front passes, a few clouds will develop and potentially even a few light snowflakes. Eventually on Saturday, that is going to be our coldest day of the week. Saturday also brings the most sunshine and we're expected to only have a high of around 31 on Saturday, but we are needing to buckle up for roller coaster temperatures this week. It is going to be cold on Friday and Saturday, but then we see our wave of warmth return on Sunday and Monday. Tuesday will be the warmest day with a high of 63, but then we come crashing again back to the colder air late Wednesday and into Thursday. That is also going to allow for those scattered showers and thunderstorms to develop, but truly a wave of temperatures for this upcoming week. It will be dry on Saturday, Sunday and Monday, but scattered showers and thunderstorms will develop on Tuesday, all a part of a larger system, bringing widespread rain and transitioning over to snow on Wednesday as that colder air will be returning. A few flurries will be possible on Thursday as well, but all in all to kick off the month of March, it is likely to be above average for this time of year. Our super seven day shows a high of 31 on Saturday with mostly sunny skies bundle up for this weekend. But next week we get another taste of spring again. Tuesday will be the warmest day with scattered showers and thunderstorms, tumbling temperatures throughout the day on Wednesday and back to the 30s on Thursday.